This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news, all right? So we're talking about Spider Loke and WAC 100. Now, both of these guys have been through a lot of stuff, and they both have good advice sometimes on the internet, okay? But there's another side that these guys hate each other. Now, Spider Loke, we know him for having his problems with 50 Cent in the past. That's been explained many different ways. Um... Again, that's between those two. We don't know what really happened. Then we got WAC 100 and Spider Loke that have their issues. And they both tell different stories. And we don't know what happened. Now, WAC 100 says he's obsessed with them. Um, Spider Loke has different version of what he feels about WAC 100. But I have to say, Spider Loke is going a bit far lately. First, he made up a story about WAC 100 and the Porsche getting uh, shot at. And the next thing he did is he just doxed uh, Blue, Blueface, WAC 100's home. I'm not going to put it up, but he put his address up. He put it out there publicly. And don't forget, Blueface just had a home invasion uh, five days ago. His family did. His mom and his pops or his step pops. That wasn't smart, and that's going far. You don't dox people. You don't give out people's addresses. That's just that's not right, man. Uh, I don't care what kind of problems you got going on with somebody. Putting someone's address out publicly like that, that's bad. Uh, I can't agree with that. Jeezy uh, and Jay-Z once had, he says, uh, Jay-Z got hands. Hove got hands because... We had to one time in Vegas fight off a bunch of people. Um, he said he spoke about his upbringing as a military brat, blah, blah, blah. Then he says uh, Jeezy admitted to questioning Jay about making business moves that would keep him on a straight and narrow path, blah, blah, blah. Then he also said uh, a time Jay-Z and his team got locked up, so he had to perform alone. Uh, I ain't got no stage manager. I don't have no manager, no nothing. Just me, Jeezy said with a laugh. However, it was a serious situation as indictments were handed down. According to the rapper, his record label turned their back on him. Oh, wait, wait, he's probably talking about the whole BMF thing. But uh, nobody, uh, they wouldn't pick up his calls. They wasn't trying to hear what I was saying. Hope called me and said, Jeezy, I got a lot of people. Uh, a lot of people don't know. We've been in some fist fights and everything. Some things uh, popped off in Vegas. I got to say, Hope got hands because we was getting down. We was back to back. I hear his sister say, Jay, get in the car. And he was like, I ain't leaving Jeezy. I was like, I rock with him. But uh, yeah, that was a hard time probably for Jeezy when everybody in BMF was getting indictments. And you know, he even got questioned. I don't know if he got indicted. I knew he, he was under some pressure from that but he was only affiliate sorry for that confusing story uh. <laughs> then we got young miami she claims jeezy's one of the best rappers he responds she innocent i agree jeezy's music there's something about it maybe he's not the most lyrical rapper but the things he's talking about very believable very inspirational i don't know what it is about it but i've always been a big fan ever since jeezy dropped of his music like I, that's always a go-to if you want to feel like you can make a billion dollars. <laughs> you put on Jeezy, man. Especially the Inspiration album. There's like four or five tracks on there that's just like... And if you want to feel like gritty, put on his first album. Kodak Black. Uh, doing a lot of donating and stuff lately, which is awesome. Uh, he donates money, wigs personalized journals to breast cancer survivors with super cindy he's doing a lot of good man you know and even though he does a lot of weird stuff he does a lot of good at the same time Nicki minaj and her husband pull up in queens uh cool they go back to the hood she ships her pink rolls royce out there cool nba young boy puts up 500k for bond he's on his way to utah we reported he made Bond earlier, uh, 500K. And now he will be paying for military guards to watch him while he's in Utah. They're supposed to keep him in line. He's on house arrest. 
I'm sure his fans are happy about that. Anyways, I'll have more news shortly. Sorry, the past I had to sl- I had to catch up on sleep, man. I went to sleep around six and didn't wake up till like an hour and a half ago. I I just I, I was run down, man. And you know I don't want to get I don't want to get under the weather or anything. So I just listened to my body and just went to sleep and woke up when I woke up. But back to the grind, man. We back. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Smash that like button and I'll check you guys in the next one. Peace.